It is the holiday season and cranberries are in full swing. So let's make an old fashioned to help us get ready for the holidays while also using those nice and ripe cranberries. Let's get this holiday season started. Welcome back to Old Fashioned Ways. Who does not love this time of year? We just finished filling our bellies with turkey and spending some time with family. Now that we have done that, the holiday season is in full swing with only a few weeks left in this year. I wanna make a holiday drink that everyone can enjoy. So with the cranberry season in full swing and reminding me of the holidays, I figured let's start with that. Yeah, sure right here. I've got about five or six great starts here. Cocktail quiz time. Cranberries are one of the few fruits native to North America. There are five states known for growing them. Can you name all five? I know I can't. Did you have cranberry sauce while eating turkey? Let me know in the comments below. There are a lot of great cranberry cocktail recipes out there, but there is one that stuck out to me because it used cranberry infused with bourbon instead of cherries. I thought this would be a nice twist for my drink. I will leave a description for it below on how to make it. Plus, if you wanna see the link of the original recipe, I will also leave that below. Now, you will have to plan for this part because it must be steeped for at least 24 hours. It's time to start preparations for next Christmas. I wanted to add another twist and orange seemed like the perfect solution for this. Let's get into the drink. The Holiday Cran Orange Old Fashioned. Ingredients for the Holiday Cran Orange Old Fashioned. One and a half ounces of bourbon, half ounce infused bourbon, one spoonful of soaked cranberries, one to two strips of orange zest, two to three dashes orange bitters, one tablespoon of maple syrup, sugared cranberries for garnish optional. All right, time to start making the Holiday Cran Orange Old Fashioned. Now this one's gonna be made directly in the Old Fashioned glass. We're gonna add a half ounce of this infused bourbon. So this is the cranberry and bourbons that are infused. We're gonna do a half ounce of that. It's okay if one of those cranberries falls in there because you're gonna be adding that in there next anyways. And it says just add a, a few of these to the bottom of it. These have been soaking for a few days, but you have to minimally soak them for 24 hours. Now we're gonna be adding one to two strips of orange zest. So I did some little zest here. And we're I'm an idiot! You're an idiot! You're an idiot! I'm just gonna add that into the bottom as well. And now we're gonna be adding two dashes of orange bitters. I have this one on hand today, so that's what I'm gonna use. Use any orange bitters you have on hand. Next, we get to add a tablespoon of maple syrup. I like using this one. My daughters discovered this one many years ago and we've carried it in the house ever since because it's got those little sparkles in it, if you can see them. We're gonna give it a little stir just to mix it up a little bit before adding the rest of the bourbon. All right, now I'm gonna add the one and a half ounces of this bourbon. I'm using Old Forester 100. I'm trying to use stuff that's easy to find for this holidays. You should be able to find this everywhere in your neighborhood. I'm just your friendly neighborhood Spider-Man. Now we're gonna add this large ice. I specifically made this one for this. It's uh, cranberries and orange slices inside an ice. And we're gonna put that in just slowly. We're now gonna give that a little stir. And we're gonna express the oils of an orange zest over the drink. And now we're gonna garnish it with this orange and cranberries. So the cranberries are covered in sugar. We did it three different ways. I did the top one, my wife did the shiny one in the middle, which we think looks the best, I agree. Then we did kind of a combination on the bottom. So we get to garnish with that. And there you have it, the Holiday Cran Orange Old Fashioned. Cocktail quiz time. Cranberries are one of the few fruits native to North America. There are five states known to grow them. Can you name all five? I know I couldn't, but they are Massachusetts, Wisconsin, New Jersey, Oregon, and Washington. So it's about time to taste this, but before we do, I'm less than 150 subscribers away from hitting 1,000. And when I hit my goal, I'll be doing a giveaway. So in case you haven't heard, I'll be giving away three H Taylors. One winner will win all three. Now it's time to taste this Holiday Cran Orange Old Fashioned. Oh wow. I didn't know if the berries would stand out, but I actually do taste the berry up front. And then I get the uh, the bourbon in between that with the maple syrup hitting the back of my tongue. I like this. I just like to smile. Smiling's my favorite. It is a little bit on the sweet side, so you could probably use a little bit less of the maple syrup if you don't want it as sweet. You like sugar, huh? Look how gorgeous this drink looks. It looks gorgeous. I smell the orange as it hits. The flavors are just so holiday. It's perfect. It's a, a berry with a little bit of citrus, with a little bit of maple, with a little bit of bourbon. Everything you want for a holiday season drink. That the Grinch's small heart grew three sizes that day. So thank you again for joining me on another journey down my old fashioned rabbit hole. This is the beginning of the holiday season and the end of another year. May your holiday season be blessed with happiness, a warm heart, and lots of family. Cheers, my friends.